Hey guys, what's up? It's Mental, and today I'm gonna show you how I uh, made the beat to attached. Um, cause you know some people were asking for it, so yeah, uh, I'll play the beat and then I'll get into it. So yeah, uh, that's the beat, and now I will show you how I made it. <laughs> okay, so to start off, um, I have this sound in Synth Mastery, is what it's called. I don't know how to use this. It's called Pluck Acoustic Gu Harpsy Guitar One. Um, this is the only sound I've ever used in it, I think. But uh, yeah, it sounds like this, and this is what I played. So yeah, um, and I put on like a lot of effects. So first, I have this gross beat that um, just like slows it down and changes the key, and also detunes it. Um, and then I threw on this low pass. Sorry, high pass. Well, it just takes the lows out a little bit, and then some delay, and this is just stereo delay, uh, pretty normal. And yeah, it sounds like this. Um, and yeah, so that's like the main melody. This is like my favorite part. This is probably one of my favorite like melodies I've made, just because it sounds so cool. Um, but yeah, next up I have the sound of serum. Uh, this is um. This is a saw wave with some glide on it, some portamento, and um, I also put some effects on it, so I'll show you without it first, um, but yeah. And I put half time on it, but I put it on like not all the way, so you can kind of hear this peeking through, and then I put delay on it, <coughs> and it sounds like this. And yeah, so next is Purity, um, and I think this is a sine wave, yeah, this is the preset simple sine uh, right here, and I put delay on it, and I think reverb, so I'll play that without any effects. I put on this EQ, just cut out some of the lows. Uh, Valhalla plate. I don't even like really know what this is, but or like what it what a plate is, but it's like reverb but like cooler. And then uh, delay. Sounds like this. Uh, it just really turns like these notes into harmonies. Um, and I really like how it sounds when, like, these notes clash, like, I don't know, it sounds cool. So yeah, that, that's what I did for that. Next, uh, this is a glockenspiel in Japan, uh, Japan, expand, <laughs> um, sorry, I'm tired. It's called Glassy Glockenspiel, and I put delay on it, so I'll just play it with the effects on. kind of a subtle sound but I think it adds to it uh, next I have this sound it's called uh, 
tiny lead in purity it sounds like this probably heard it in pug and b i turn the velocity all the way down so it's almost like a so sine wave but it still has like a little you know different sound to it um and i'll play this in no effects and with the effects i put half time halfway um so you can hear both delay chorus and distortion and an eq this is kind of a weird eq i don't know why i did this but i did it so yeah sounds like that um lastly i did the square lead in serum uh with some glide on it and yeah that's kind of it also i have always checked so you know does that um and i just put the lay on it and yeah that's it so here it is That's it, just plays that. So I'll play all the mouths together. And yeah, here it is. So yeah, uh, next I'll show you the drums. So the drums are actually really simple on this. Um, I'll start off with the 808, which is probably the most complicated thing, uh, and I'll play it. So, uh, this is something I really like to do. I don't really do it that often, but it sounds really cool, uh, where you just, like, slide at the very beginning, and it makes the second 808 hit a lot harder. Um, and I did it over here too. And um, I also have this like high pitch part. But yeah, I just like to do that a lot. It sounds really good at the end of bars also, but I like it a lot at the beginning too. Um, next I have this kick, and I'll play these both together. Um, I side chained the kick uh, to the 808, so it sounds like this. So, um, it doesn't hit every single time the 808 does, but, um, it's like most of the time. And the side chain isn't that crazy either. It's just very slight. Um, next I'll play the clap one time, because you don't have to listen to the whole thing. It's just a normal four step. Uh, then this hat. Pretty simple. The snares I'll play together with the hat so you can like have reference. Um, I guess I'll zoom in so you can see the pattern a little more. Um, something kind of unique about my snare patterns, I really like to put it like on the whatever this is called on the beat I guess. Um, rather than like in the middle because it just kind of emphasizes the clap a lot more if you listen it sounds really cool versus if I did it like that's kind of like boring but this sounds cool Um, and then lastly I just have this prick that hits just that so yeah um, I'll play all the drums together now. So, also, um, at the end of like the hook, what I like to do is take the clap away, the last clap. Uh, it just kind of gives more emphasis, so I'll just play it from here. Yeah, I just like how that sounds.
Um, so I guess the last thing I can show you is the uh, um, like little noises and effects and stuff. Um, let me just mute my vocals. So first I have this. Then I have um, this transition thing. Uh, then this plug and be uh, riser, no, not riser, but like perk, I guess. I don't know. That's a pretty like common sound, and then that just plays throughout. Um, and yeah, I think that's it for this beat. Um, if you guys like this video, then that makes me happy. Um, I'm gonna try to post more. Uh, I don't really go on this computer that much. This is like my old computer. Um, I really only have used this to, like, record, um, the last beat breakdown, so, until I drop new music, I'm, I just have to come back on here to film, uh, my, like, beat breakdowns, but I want to keep doing this, it's really fun, uh, and it makes me happy that I can, like, inspire people and teach people, like, what I do, um, oh, there's one more thing I forgot about, this chant, it's just, like, you know, <laughs> okay, anyways, back to what I was saying, um, until I film, or not film, until I record new music and post it, um, I have to come on here to break down my beats, because I don't have them on my other computer, so, that's why, like, I don't post them that much, but, like, I really, like, want to do this for, like, every song, because, I don't know, I think it's just really cool to be able to share, like, what I know, and, uh, teach people, but yeah, um, I'm going to do more of these for sure. And also I'm going to uh, link with Bluxty and some other people next month. Or not next month, at the end of this month. So I'm going to try to film videos there. Maybe like a vlog or something, I don't know. But we'll see, it'll be cool. But yeah, um, I think that's it. Thanks for watching. I love you and have a good night.